Jim Tucker with the American Free Press is reporting that the secretive global power broker Bilderberg Group is likely to take the unprecedented step of holding its meeting for two years running in the United States. Bilderberg may meet in Virginia again. There is strong evidence that Bilderberg will return to Chantilly, Virginia for its annual closed meeting June 22nd, 24th, 2013 at the posh Westfields Marriott near the Dulles Airport. Westfields is booked up for that weekend and individuals are unable to make a one-room reservation even five months in advance. Now, if you go through the history of Bilderberg meetings, as a lot of people will know, it would be completely unprecedented for Bilderberg not to take place somewhere in Europe this year. Because since its founding in 1954, the group has never met in the United States for two years running. It's never happened. So Jim Tucker, obviously on target most of the time, but we also know that Bilderberg sometimes puts out a dummy location uh, to throw people off the scent because, of course, the activists, the journalists descend on their secret conference. Sometimes they use a different hotel. Sometimes they try to throw people off the scent by uh, tantalizing a different location entirely. So just to test this out, I went on the Washington Dulles Marriott Hotel website to try and make a booking for the dates in question that Tucker mentioned in his article as the probable meeting date of Bilderberg. So we're going to check in on the 22nd of June, check out on the 24th of June and see what we get. Click find. And now there are actually rooms available, which is interesting because earlier today I tried this and there were no rooms available for that date. What I also tried though earlier on is setting the um, check-in date for the 20th of June couple of days before Tucker says Bilderberg are going to meet and then running it until say the 27th so that covers the entirety of the meeting if it took place over that weekend so a quick search for that date says no rooms available at this property so that's interesting and there's a search for the 25th to the 27th uh, in which there are rooms available so it looks like the weekend named by Tucker, 22nd to 24th, is available for booking, which of course means that Bilderberg can't be staying at the Washington Dullers that weekend, which is interesting because just a few hours ago I checked it, and, and between the dates of 22nd and 24th of June, there were no rooms available, but now there are. So, you know, have they changed it in response to this article or what? But for sure, if they're allowing you to book a room on the weekend of the 22nd to the 24th of June, that pretty much rules out that weekend for Bilderberg's meeting. And I've also checked the dates all the weekends in May and all the weekends in July, uh, as well as June, of course. So at the moment, the Marriott is allowing you to book a room throughout May, June and July, which are the three months in which Bilderberg is likely to take place. So at the moment, it looks like Bilderberg will still be meeting in Europe and that this whole idea about the meeting in the United States for two years running is probably incorrect at this moment in time. But of course, we're only in February. The meeting is some four months or more away. But of course, Jim Tucker, the American Free Press, routinely pin down the location uh, probably on average around a month before the meeting actually takes place so be sure to keep checking out AmericanFreePress.net and of course Infowars.com for the latest information on Bilderberg. Now of course we know why Bilderberg is likely to be considering meeting in the United States for two years running because routinely when the conference takes place in Europe the press coverage is more intense to a degree where now they're talking between themselves in secret meetings about how, quote, their constant exposure 
is causing them problems. That was a conversation between uh, Richard Armitage, Dep Deputy Secretary of State under George W. Bush, and others, including Timothy Geithner, at a Bilderberg North American group meeting back at the end of November. So we know they're incensed about the constant press coverage in Europe last time, 2011, when the conference was held in Europe. It garnered global media attention, even more so uh, than when the conference was held in Washington in Chantilly the following year. And of course, at that conference, London Guardian writer Charlie Skelton revealed that Bilderberg members inside the hotel had referred to the protesters outside as, quote, cockroaches. That's what they think of as, cockroaches. And then at the 2010 Bilderberg meeting in Spain, Bilderberg members lamented the fact that protesters and journalists even had the financial means to travel in order to cover this global summit of 200 of the most powerful people on the planet that the mainstream media routinely either ignores or downplays. So no confirmation as yet that Bilderberg will meet again in an unprecedented move in the United States. Seems to me that it's more likely that they'll follow their usual pattern and select some out-of-the-way resort in a European country Last time it was halfway up a mountain. Sometimes they go to places like Greece where the police presence doesn't even allow the protesters anywhere near the hotel. And it seems like they will follow their normal pattern in meeting in Europe, but still discussion about the potential of the 2013 Bilderberg meeting taking place in the United States for an unprecedented second year running. We'll keep you up to date I'm Paul Joseph Watson reporting for InfoWars.com.